Okay, my name is Marvin Ojo. I'm from Nigeria and I'm going to be teaching Olivia how to dance. And what are you going to teach me how to dance? I'm going to teach her the Zonto, Etigi and most likely Shako Shako. So the first dance move I'm going to teach you is called Etigi. Etigi? Etigi. Etigi. E-T-I-G-I. Etigi. Okay. It's from Southern Nigeria. Okay. Um, I would say Cross River, Koyabong, Delta, that area. And it's literally just making use of your lower body. Okay. Your hips, mostly. And it's going to be a bit tough. Okay. So, the first move you have to do is try to stand and give gap a bit. Okay. To your legs. Okay. Try to raise this leg up. And try to isolate the muscles here if you can. So you go like this, and when you do that, you take the hand back, the hand, like that, and you go like this. <laughs> so now you try to take it faster and hold it. <laughs> I feel like a soldier. <laughs> like marching. So you just go. Then if you want to make it, you can just add some flow again. You can do anything with your hand, you can go and fight. Whatever you want to do, just press it down. But just make sure the movement here is still going. <laughs> when you see people dancing, yeah. it looks easy, but like it is actually hard. Yeah. Now you can move the hands. So the hand should be backwards. Hit the leg. If it's your right leg coming up, your right hand should be back. If it's your left leg coming up, your left hand should be back. So that's what it's like this. Okay, that was a good thing. So what we're going to do right now yes. is called Azonto. Azonto? Yeah. The rivalry between Nigerians and Ghanians okay. about who owns Azonto. Okay. So, personally for me, I think the dance move Azonto came from Ghana, yeah. where a Nigerian musician called Whiskey okay. made a song on it and made the dance move popular to the world. Got so it. So Nigerians claim it because they made it known, even though it's originally from Ghana. Got it. Got so, Azondo has a lot of shoulder and lower leg movement. So I'm going to start with the lower leg movement because okay. that's the most important part of Azondo. Okay. Just, just put, make this leg free, then kick. Then when you kick in, you see you're making a little bounce on your left leg. Yeah. Making a little bounce, a little bounce. Like that. Then put this, put the hand, pump this hand like you're making a pump, like you're punching downwards. Where the leg is going, you can just take it slowly, like this, slow. Now take it up. <laughs> Down in. Up. Now so now you go like this. You slide. <laughs> My shoes get sticky. <laughs> then you go to the right. This time. So when you go to get to that direction, yeah. you change your head movement. Yeah. You go, you change, you go, you change, you go. Part of it. Kind of like I'm taking a kickboxing class, right? That's how it feels actually. Like. <laughs> boxing, yeah, boxing up, boxing, yeah, or sideways.
Đất 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 Yeah, bounce. I'm great bounce. Yeah. <laughs> now let's go. <laughs> so now you move with your hands. Yeah, try to move it. So this is, it's like rubbing your like belly and patting your hands. I'm like, I'm a beginner, so I'm close. Which one is this one called again? Shaco Shaco. Shaco Shaco. All right. Let's walk out of the zone. What? More technique. Okay. More condition. It's really hard. So even I myself, I'm actually right okay. now novice teaching how to do this because okay. I don't know it so well. Novice and But beginner. I just, I just feel like I'll be doing the disservice to so many Nigerians out there if yeah. I don't teach Sakusha. Okay, okay. Well, we don't want to disappoint anyone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Thanks for watching this episode of Olivia Mates World. You can catch the next episode right here on the UNI International Admissions Facebook page.